Welcome back to my channel. Today's video, I am going to be doing a Brazilian blowout on my client, and it's a special guest. It's a family member of mine, which I really love, and she was the perfect candidate for this video. So, like I said, we're going to be doing the Brazilian blowout on her. I did this video probably a few months ago, and I'm just now posting it. Sorry for the delay, the holidays had me tripping, so I'm back on track and I just wanted to share this video with y'all because it's a very good video. If you've never done a Brazilian blowout or if you're thinking about it or if you have questions about it to see how it works. So let's go ahead and get right to it. So here we are. This is her hair. This is gonna be our before. I just want to show you how thick and wavy her hair is. It's so natural. She's got a lot of frizz. She does have some gray. We do want to touch up her color, but I'm gonna say that for another video. This video is just to show you how this Brazilian blowout works. I want to show you what it looks like before, why it's good for your hair, and what the results will be after and she's got a lot of hair it's so thick and i felt like she was a great candidate for this video so let's go ahead and get started all right guys so this is going to be the first step for the brazilian blowout you are going to use the ionic cleanser which clarifies the hair takes away all the buildup that's around the scalp through the hair and if you get somebody with thick hair um, or very coarse curly, you can do this a few times to make sure that you really cleanse the hair very well. So once we're done using the step one, I am going to towel dry her very well and we're going to go ahead and get ready for the second step, but you have to make sure that you really do cleanse the hair very well. So if you feel like you have to wash it a few times, please do, do not get scared. Okay guys, so this is actually step two and we are prepping our hair. I'm just gonna go ahead and brush it out, make sure I get all the tangles so that way it'll be easy for me to go through each section and apply the product very well and smooth. Um, this step two is actually going to smooth and condition the hair, creating a protective protein layer around the hair shaft to create a really nice smooth surface of the cuticle to eliminate all the frizz so this stuff is very strong I like to wear my glasses and put a mask over just so I won't be breathing in any heavily chemicals and I also like to make sure my client is also secured as well product is all in it's sitting in and we're gonna get ready to blow dry but this is what it looks like after the second step so let's go ahead and get started to blow drying and see what the results look like all right guys so here i'm just going to go ahead and power dryer before i actually start round brushing just to make it easier on myself that's her hair after we just did a blow dry from the actual solution this is what it looks like we haven't even straightened, I just want to show you how smooth her hair looks already and what we're going for and what this process is going to look like and all these steps that we're doing. So now we're going to go ahead and get to straightening just to kind of see what it actually really looks like. So it's amazing how 
will this product really work though? So let's go ahead and get to it. So here we are, now we're straightening after we just got through blow drying the hair very smooth. And like I said, you do want to make sure that you blow dry the product into the hair very well before straightening. So now that we're going to go ahead and go through all her hair and straighten it, I usually do each strand about 10 times of flat ironing and make sure I comb through very well. That way it seals in very nicely. So guys, here we are. This is the last step and this is going to be step three, which is the ionic bonding spray. This is what's going to go ahead and seal the cuticle of the hair and you're going to have to repeat all those steps that we just did, meaning wash it all out and then you go in with step three and you spray after you towel dry very well, but you have to make sure that you rinse all that product that you used step two. Make sure you've rinsed it out very well. Go ahead and towel dry the hair and spray your step three. And then you can go ahead and to get into blow drying and then flat ironing as normal. You don't have to do it all perfectly because it's gonna just it's gonna be a lot easier than the first time because the first time when you're blow drying, you're gonna have to get all that product dried in the hair very well versus doing it now and all over again. You'll feel a difference. guys so this is the end of the results I am so happy I love her hair it was so thick and coarse and brittle from the very beginning and I've been telling her about this product and I know she is so thrilled to like even enjoy her hair now because before she couldn't do her hair it was hard for her to brush style whatever the case was for her but as you can see she's got doll hair now and yeah, I went through, I did a little trim, but anything, I really just cleaned it up. And honestly, like, I am just amazed by the results. And for those of you who have thick, coarse, brittle hair or just frizziness, this is the perfect product for you. So, and this goes for guys, girls. This is just awesome, and I'm happy that she's happy, and I love making my clients beautiful, so that's it. All right, guys, that's it for today's video, and I hope you enjoyed it. I hope it was very helpful. If you have any questions about it, please feel free to comment down below. I will be happy to answer anything about this product, whatever question you may have. Again, thanks, guys, for watching. Please remember to subscribe for more videos to come. And like I said, I'm sorry I'm posting this video late, but you know what? I felt like it was something really, really needed to post, especially for ladies, guys, who have never done the Brazilian blowout or is curious how it works, how it flows. So, like I said, remember to hit the subscribe button for more videos to come. Again, comment down below if any questions and I will check you out next video. Take care.